Muen pa I Asian, but I love me some Haitian food. Let's get it. Making some Haitian griots. You gotta get it soaking in some lime juice, lemon juice, and some vinegar. And they normally use sour orange, but I don't got none of that. So we just gonna let that soak up and we'll be right back. All right, after you let it soak, you gotta strain out that juice and wash that meat a little bit more. Yes, just like that. Yes, ma'am. Okay, and then you're gonna blanch your pork shoulder with some boiling water. I don't know why, but do it. Just do it. <laughs> it's gonna, it, yeah. And then you pour that out as well. And then we got our epis here. And I need to make a recipe video on this, but it's a, basically a bunch of green stuff, like parsley and all the good herbs. <laughs> then you mix it together. Yeah, and then you put that on your um, pork, and then you got this Sazon seasoning. Then you get your complete seasoning in there. Garlic and onion powder. Paprika and some black pepper. And yep, that was empty. This pollo seasoning. You gotta put that stuff in everything. I know it ain't chicken, but y'all, it just brings it just brings a taste. In this um tropical um I forget what it was called. But yeah, I'll put that in there. Oh, and I almost forgot lemon juice or lime. I don't think it matters to be honest. They both taste the same to me. <laughs> what is that face? I don't know what I was doing. Now mix that up like crazy. It was kind of hard to mix it up, but I got it. Going, I'm going to put it in the fridge and let it sit overnight. Now either use a habanero or scotch bonnet, and then they put some, uh, what are they called? Cloves in there. And then get some, you know, better than bouillon stuff and put some water in it. And then pour it on in there. It gives it some flavor instead of adding plain water, you know. And now we're going to make the rice and beans. So get your epis and the same and some chicken bouillon seasoning and oil and stir that up. Then put your black beans in there. Boil your beans till they're al dente and then cook your pork for 30 minutes. Oh my minutes. gosh, I'm going so fast. Fry your stuff, I guess. And then get some veggies and fry them up. If you don't know how to make rice and beans, I'm sorry. <laughs> but y'all, this was really good. Look how pretty the presentation. Look at all those colors. Uh, oh, the fried plantains. You cannot forget that. Never, never, never. And then, um, it, the, oh my gosh, Brenda, bro. Um, you mix a Maggie cube and some vinegar and you plop it on in there and then fry it again. I'm sorry, y'all. I went too fast, but... Y'all, it was wonderful. I hope you guys make it. Tag me. Bye.